Imagine immigrating to Canada on the last flight before India from India before COVID shutdowns, then trying to find work as businesses closed, and then battling COVID and not finding anywhere to turn for support. That's what's happened to a family that now calls Saanich home, and their experience prompted them to start the Fat A Care charity. Tass Van Stratton brings us their story in their words in this week's Vital People. I'm Navneet, Navneet Kaur Popli. Harjas Singh Popli. So we moved to Canada of, uh, in 2020, March. It's the moment we landed, uh, there was complete lockdown. People were losing jobs while we were trying to find one. I started my working uh, in Surrey. Uh, I used to go there Monday, come back Thursday. I got COVID, uh, lost a lot of things. Because of me, Navneet and both children got COVID. And then those 20, 23 days uh, were really horrible. We needed all the help we could at that particular time, being new to the country and uh, being new to everything down with COVID. We tried reaching out. We asked for all of all the help we, you know, we could ask uh, back then, but we did not get it. And that's what we realized that we, there is a need to give care to the to people to communities and that's where we started Fateh Care. Fateh um, it means victory. So we're saying we at Fateh Care we win hearts by caring. Just let me know your address. I will bring food to you and I won't charge anything. So we realize that it's not just COVID. There will be people who will be suffering from all kinds of different things. So that is why when requests come to um, us we do not ask questions. Uh, we just, we just in good faith go and give people uh, what they require at that particular time. Since we did not get the help, um, why should we help? Right at front, you know, the, the thought came, no, if, if we did not get it, uh, you know, might as well give so that, you know, let's build a better community around us. So tomorrow, if again I have to get into a situation like this, I should be able to get help. How many people have you helped at this point? About 1,400 plus already. Sometimes it would be difficult to just look at their eyes when it is to receive those things. They would just start crying. So I realized the importance of the work that he decided to do. It's in our community uh, to give back. We've seen our parents, we've seen our community give back. That's a rule in our faith. If you're earning anything, 10% of it has to be given to the community. We cannot use it for ourselves. So, like, giving back is something which has been instilled in us right from the day we were born. So we've gone past 10% right now, but that's okay. That's absolutely fine. And Fateh Caring is a way of life for us now. Vital People, brought to you by the Victoria Foundation. Connecting people who care with causes that matter.